Hello everybody and welcome to Friday's Five Old Gays. Um Michael spoke about B. Arthur, may she rest in peace. Yeah, and um and said why do we have gay icons or what makes her a gay icon and I don't know. I, I couldn't answer why she would be a gay icon because I I love her too just as much as anybody else. But um Maybe it was her raspy voice. Don't know. I I I couldn't I couldn't pinpoint it because I look at other gay icons and um, the only thing that I find all of them have in common is that they were women. I mean, you look at Cher. Must she just have a raspy voice too? Uh, Marilyn Monroe. No correlation. Uh, Tina Turner. Patti Labelle. Um, Madonna, and for the newer generations, Britney Spears, Paris Hilton. Don't know, don't know. And uh, could it be controversy? No, not everybody's controversial. Could it be the masculinity within the femininity? The not so much the masculinity. What I'm trying to get at is that there were strong women. Not all of them. Don't know. Well, but you know something? I didn't like the way Maude treated Mike. So I decided. Speed dial. I also have speed dial. I'm calling 1987. Hello? Hello, is this Dorothy? Yes, it is. Yes. Well, my friend Michael called, and he said, "Um, he well, he called Maud in the seventies, so I decided to call you in the eighties, eighty-seven. Yeah, and I'm also from the future. Um, and he called because he said he was calling about the gay issue. I, I don't know if you remember that, but do you think he's gay? No, he isn't. When he spoke to you back then, he, he was really, in a way, kind of distraught. What? What? He, he's not himself lately, and uh, he looks bloody awful. Bloody awful. He said he was sick, but I know he's distraught. He, so if you could find a way in your heart to actually give him a call. Oh, oh my god. Yes, uh, all right, all right. What is it? It might be 1987, but one thing, she still doesn't know how to say goodbye. Yeah, but you know something, people? I haven't been feeling well myself. No, I've been feeling achy and... Uh, just a little feverish and stuff. And, then, you know, I'm kind of feeling like... I don't know what's going on. I'm just not feeling like myself either. Well, anyway, everybody have a good weekend, and I'll catch you guys later, okay? De lo veo.